Remember Army surplus stores? The only one in Abilene was destroyed by fire about five years ago. But camo and historic pieces are back, along with lots of other things, fulfilling an Abilene man's dream. And KTAB's Jessica Rank takes us on a brief tour. This one's a strategic air command suit, Randolph. As an adult, you go to places and smells will take you back to your childhood. This one is from the late 20s, early 30s. Two of those smells for me are an old-fashioned feed store and an army surplus store. Even though Edwin Bumpus didn't serve in the military. I see, this is Korea era. He's always been drawn to the green and brown. You walk in and you smell the, the canvas and the, the rain gear and the camo. And as a child, he and his father spent a lot of time at Taylor's. My mom and my brother, they didn't like the stuff we like. Sifting through the little treasures at the Army surplus store. Part of the fun of it is getting to dig, you know, because there's bins full of stuff and boxes that you dig through and, and you always find something different. But back in 2016, all the memories and smells were left behind after the store burned in a fire. There was just a real big hole left. A hole that Bumpus is now trying to fill five years later. Later. I asked him, you know, what do you think about me opening up a surplus store? He was like, you know, I really had thought about calling you to see if you would pursue it. And with permission from the former store owner, Bumpus is creating new memories. These are flight jackets from the Korea. While looking through old ones. It's like a setback in history. And even though it's a new look with some different stuff, Bumpus says the feeling of looking through history. You kind of take a look inside their life. Hasn't changed. In Abilene with coverage you can count on, Jessica Rank, KTAB News. I'm ready to go right now. It's just down the street. Thank you, Jessica. Taylor's Army Surplus was on North First. As you saw, the sign and concrete slab are about all that's left. The new store is at about the Abilene city limits on U.S. Highway 277 South as you head towards Bronton, San Angelo.